but also a very simple one. And let me explain. I have committed my life to public service. It's been eight years in the, in the Navy active duty, 12 years in the United States Reserves. When I ran for the county commission back in 2004, the urging some of my friends, I had to give it careful consideration because let me be very straight, I was disgusted with politics, like a lot of you. I really felt as if those in office did not speak to me, despite the fact that men like Chris and others here at the local level really giving it their all. And that's the reason I ran for local office. Because I understood we faced many, many problems. The answers, I'm not trying to be cliche, but the answers are not going to come from Washington. They're going to come from civic associations. They're going to come from small gatherings of, of citizens working together with their city council and their mayors and, and state government to try to solve problems. So it's been an honor for me to serve as a county commissioner and a great learning experience. But folks, and you understand this, we're in a moment of peril. We're in a crisis. The country's in a crisis. And I feel like you, a duty and an obligation to help deal with that crisis. The one thing I learned when I taught history, American history, is that our country has faced crises before. From the very beginning, I mean, you go back to Valley Forge when it looked bleak, and that's always when we were at our best. In a crisis, back to the wall, we respond well. And what those who really don't understand America fail to understand is when we look weak, we're actually at our strongest. It's when we come together. And that, for me, really is who I am. I, I'm a bridge builder. I like to build. I like to build bridges. I believe in infrastructure. I believe in education. But I believe in bringing people together, solving problems at home, at the local level, but working together, not tearing people apart. That's not who I am. It's never been who I am. And it's not who I'll be. So in this current crisis, I believe we're really at the beginning of something truly great for our country. And I believe that if everybody, left, right, center, Republican, Democrat, Independent, everyone, just decides to come together, and tackle some really challenging problems, but deal with them and recognize, as I have as a commissioner, and I've done this many, many times, I cast votes and I'll sometimes call out my wife and say, you know, honey, that might be perhaps not the last vote I'm going to cast, but I may have put my career at risk. But I'm happy doing it because I know that what I've done was right, and I'm not here trying to pursue a lifetime in politics. So I want to do the right thing at this moment in our country's history when we're facing a crisis. I absolutely believe that we are at the beginning of something truly great for America. And I want to be part of that. Which is why, when I'm done answering all your questions, I'm going to file the paperwork to run for the United States Congress, District 11. It's going to be challenging, but I'm up to the challenge, and so are you. It's going to be exciting. I think it's going to be a new beginning for our nation. And so, with that, let me state again, thank you and God bless you for coming out here. Let's go to work. Our country needs you. And I'm ready, along with you, to do what's best for America. Thank you very much.